Hello everyone. So today we start with the subject construction technique and equipment and the first video lecture is on chapter 1 that is human resource management and construction planning. So what is human resource management? Human resource management is a process of bringing people and organizations together so that the goals of each other are met. The human resource means the human resource means the manpower. That is defined as the human resource. organization It can be either a hospital, it can be a company, it can be any institute or any other organization, either in the public or in the private sector. Hey, organization tour, zikhini goals thake, zikhini kam thake kore bo karne, hey, kam khini korar karne, zikhini amak manpower lage, ba zikhini employee lage, hey, gude khini eke loge anato, that entire process is known as the human resource management. Now, what is the scope of human resource management? The scope of human resource management is very wide and can be categorized as follows. Tinta category as the personal aspect, welfare aspect and industrial relations aspect. The personal aspect, personal means what? Personal means the employees. The organization to the employee thake, the employee bilak of personal bilak was So this is concerned with manpower planning. Manpower means the human resource, the employees. The manpower planning, recruitment. Recruitment means it is the process of uh, selection of the uh, candidates for the job. Mane recruitment mane tumar entire process to hobo starting from amak uh, zikunata organization is to plan koru boki ikhini kamo karne amak iman khini manhu lage he manhu khini karne hiyote vacancy uliabo vacancy karne advertisement dibo publish koru bo tate manhu bilake apply koru bo form fill up koru bo interview pata jabo that entire process is known as recruitment selection now what is selection selection is the final process of the uh, recruitment, zito recruitment or pisot hoy. Recruitment or is the recruitment is the entire process. Our tar pisot ki hoy, he process through pisot interviews interview lower pisot ki hoy. Finally, the candidates, the desire, the deserving candidates are selected for the job for the position, and that process is known as the selection. Zot ani ziblak undeserving hoy, ziblak ko kami cancel kore dio, reject kore dio, or ziblak deserving hoy ani akal hiho ta klo. That is known as selection. Placement, placement as you all know, the black companies bilako the black interview lo place the black selection hoy that is known as placement. Transfer, zikuno ata ata organization or itu branch or pra belag ata branch le zwa ba ata office or pra itu ata office ba belag jaga lo belag ekhon district or pra ekhon district lo zwa that all comes under transfer. Promotion, mane ata lower rank or pra ata higher rank or lekhe tomar promotion hoa. Training and development that is uh, will be provided in the organization. Training to a short term process. Why? Did you join Koratik Pisote? Ba either uh, in the subsequently Pisole Kyo, Maze Maze, the training programs will conduct Korazai. So to Maloko, either you, you are imparted with different kinds of knowledge. Either you are given technical knowledge or Zitu Zitu employer Zitu particular job. Why? Zizon employee. Zitu job hoy, hey job hisabe training to diazai. And uh, development to beleg hoy, development is they are more or less similar training and development, but the difference is that training to the short term process hoy and development is a long term process. Development to throughout the uh, working life, development to continuously hoy thake because training to ki hoy, training is the basic difference is that training to zikun hata particular job or kane diazai. Ki kunbaz on employee ki bata particular kam diazai, hey kam to halke kori bo kane zikini knowledge diazai, but zikini skills diazai, that is known as training. But development is the all round development. Mane zikun hata employer, gute personality to ba gute attitude, gute kine zitu mane. Uh, uh, improvement hobo that will come under development and hetu karne it will it is not a short term process but it is a long term process that will go on throughout your working life layoff and retrenchment now what is layoff uh the organization not uh, there can be uh, times when employees will have a uh, particular employee either it can be temporary or permanent temporarily he is an employee is on, he is on one single person he employees on or back is an employer uh, like a group of people not a and in that case 
সিহতক লে অফ করে দিয়া যায় লে অফ মানে সিহতক কামৰ পৰা গুছাই দিয়া যায় ইট ক্যান বি আইদার টেম্পোরারি অর পার্মানেন্ট যি কোনো এটা টেম্পোরারি পিরিয়ডৰ কাৰণে হে মানুহখিনিক না লাগে সো কোম্পানিটোৰ পৰা বা অৰগানাইজেচনৰ পৰা গুছাই দিছে আকো লাগা তো এমত সিহতক আকো আনলো এনেছে অর ইট ক্যান বি পার্মানেন্ট কি পার্মানেন্টলি হটৰ কোম্পানি অৰগানাইজেচনৰ পৰা উলিয়াই দিয়া গৈছে বিকজ হটৰ আৰু কোনো ধৰণৰ দৰকাৰ নাই অৰগানাইজেচনৰ এণ্ড হোৱাট ইজ ৰিট্ৰেনচমেন্ট ৰিট্ৰেনচমেন্ট ইজ দা ৰিডাকচন ইন দা কোৱান্টিটি অৰ ইন দা কস্ট মানে তোমালোকৰ অৰগানাইজেচনৰ কস্ট কাটিং চলি আছে কি মানে যিখিনি মানে এক্সপেন্ডিচার হয় অর্গানাইজেশনটোর সেইখিনি রিডাকশন করার ট্রাই করে আছে সো দ্যাট ইউ ক্যান গেট মোর দা অর্গানাইজেশন ক্যান বেনিফিট মোর ফাইনেন্সিয়ালি সো যেটা কস্ট কাটিং হয় তো বিভিন্ন ধরনের বস্তু কমাবলগা হয়ে যায় আইদার এমপ্লয়ীজ নাম্বার অফ এমপ্লয়ীজ কমাবলগা হয়ে যায় বা এমপ্লয়ীজর দরমহা কমাবলগা হয়ে যায় সো দ্যাট এভ্রিথিং everything like that comes under retrenchment next is remuneration remuneration is obviously the payment that you give to the employees incentives to ki hoy that is something uh, that comes extra to the payment remuneration to is it my monthly payment by yearly payment whatever you pay like a salary but incentive to it's like a bonus due to payment of ke extra ke diya jay so so as to motivate the employees employees black is that aru bhal ke kaam kore in uh, either in regular intervals or there can be uh, during special festivals ten kwa time jikin extra ke diya jay that is known as incentive and productivity jitu mane jikuno eta employee kiman khini kaam korise kiman khini output dise bhal ke dibo parisen na everything will come under productivity next is the welfare aspect it deals with working conditions and amenities such as canteen creches you know what is canteen now what is creches uh, creche is uh, suppose uh, you have uh, uh, the employees they have either newborn babies or they have young children kumba jodi parents ase tate kaam kori thaka jar ekdom hoyto bot kesua ase no hoyto ekdom poru lora chali ase jak ঘরত অকলে এরি থাই আহিব নয় বা স্কুলত পঠাব পড়া হওয়া নাই হওয়া বহু সরু হয়ে আছে দেন দেয়ার আর দেয়ার ইজ দে হ্যাভ টু দা অর্গানাইজেশন দে প্রভাইড উইথ দা ফেসিলিটিজ দ্যাট ইজ নোন এজ দা ক্রেশ যেটু একটা ইটস লাইক আ নার্সারি যত তাতে নিউবর্ন বেবিজ হক বা ভেরি ইয়াং চিলড্রেন হেবলাক তাতে রাখিব পারি এন্ড তাতে কেয়ার লওয়া হয় দে হ্যাভ পিপল দেয়ার ইনসাইড দা অর্গানাইজেশন দেয়ার ইজ আ স্পেশাল uh place for the crash where the people will be appointed to take care of the young children of the or the babies of the employees those are known as crashes rest and lunch room housing housing mane kisman organization or pa thakibo diya hoy employees bilak quarters diya jay transport like uh, you know the transport facilities diya jay to travel to and fro the offices medical assistance kun ba employee jodi kun ba dhoronor medical expenses thake high expenses hebla kisuman organization e hetu kharch uthai either of the employee or even the employee's family kisuman organization e employer mak deutak ba uh, wife hok husband hok ba lora chali he expense to organization e uthai so that assistance is known as the medical assistance education lora chali porha uh, porhonar kharch hok health and safety recreation facilities now what is recreation recreation mane jekhini tumaloka office at kaam kara he kaam khini time khini bahut you work very sincerely so he khini time bahut kosto hoy there is a lot of hard work so you need a little distraction from the work jekhini kaam jekhini okoman hekini kaam kara na jay office or kaam kara na jay but that time is meant to have fun or to enjoy like kisman organization at dekha jay besibak organization te dekha jay like on some days or on holidays they organize parties they organize games they organize events outdoor functions kara jay those everything will come under recreation facilities next is the industrial relations aspect this covers union management relations union mane je bilak employees hoy employees or major je to union mane it's like a group je to sangathan kara hoy that is known as union and management mane hoyse je bilak employer employee mane hoyse je bilak kaam kore ar employer mane hoyse jone kaam tu die mane je bilak owner hoy or the bosses those are known as the employers and they come under the management so union or management or major relation to it run dot poribo joint consultation mane durure majot consultation collective bargaining either for uh, salaries or incentives or other facilities jitu kane bargaining hobo pare grievance mane uh, employer uh, kiba dhoronor complaint thakibo pare company tu loi ple tare working conditions loi ba kunba belek particular employee loi ple colleague loi ple kiba complaint thakibo pare he complaint tu jate hote file korbo pare within the organization that is known as grievance and disciplinary procedures settlement of disputes mane kamar majot kiba kajia laga ba kiba kajia ba kunu dhoronor kiba argument hole je to settle koribo lagibo that everything will come under the industrial relations aspect next we come to the functions of human resource management 
the functions performed by human resource management can be broadly classified into two categories. Duta category thake of uh, functions of human resource management. The first one is the managerial functions and the second one is the operative functions. So firstly, let us come to the managerial functions. Here under first for a planning. Now what is planning? Planning is a predetermined course of actions. It is a process of determining the organizational goals and formulation of policies and programs for achieving them. Mane, zi kunu eta kam korar agote, zi kini actions bila kore bo lege bo he kam to karne, he kam to korar agote, zi kini plan korar zai ki, ame kam to keneke korin, ame ki ki goal set kore su, mane ame ki ki achieve kore bo lege bo, ame iman kini time or ame iman kini achieve kore bo lege bo, ba amar ekhini ekhini rule hobo kam kini kore bo karne, ame enu ka enu ka programs conduct korin, that entire process is known as the planning. Next comes the organizing. Now, organization is a process by which the structure and allocation of jobs are determined. Thus, organizing involves giving each subordinate a specific task, establishing departments, delegating authority to subordinates, establishing channels or authority and communication, coordinating the work of subordinates, and so on. Mane organizing means ki hoy mane kunzon employee kuntu kam kori bo ka kil hona kam dia zabo kun kuntu manhu ki kam kori bo kani suitable hoy. Hey, gute kine decide kora to ba gute kine kam to ami zito kam to dim. That is known as delegating. Kam dia to delegate kora bolle koy. That is known as organizing. Next comes staffing. This is the process by which managers select, train, promote and retire their subordinates. This involves deciding what type of people should be hired, recruiting prospective employees, selecting employees, setting performance standard, compensating employees, evaluating performance, counseling employees, training and developing employees. Mane, zikhini agote already uh, I have told you ki hoi selection ki hoi training ki hoi promotion ki hoi. So a gute khini, this all these functions will come under stuffing. Mane kaka kami select uh, organization to kaka kenu kwa dhona manhu select kori bo lebo kenu kwa dhona manhu lage. That entire process hey manhu khini kloe play hiyo training kori wa. That's a job kwaar pisaan hiyo to promotion ba when uh, the time comes for retirement hiyo to retirement kini everything, everything will come under stuffing. Next is directing or leading. Now, directing is the process of activating group efforts to achieve the desired goals. It includes activities like getting subordinates to get the job done, maintaining morale, motivating subordinates, etc. for achieving the goals of the organization. Now, leading money ki tumala ke zana, what is a leader? Leader e ki kore, nizor talot zibla ke kaam kore, hi ho tak, kaam khini kene ke kori bola ke, hi khini help kora, ba motivate kora, moral support diya, ba kene ke ki kori bola, ibo gute khini ho tak hikai dato, that is known as leading. So, same in case of organization. This is on director thake ba, this is on leader thake. They are under zibla subordinates thake bo. What do you mean by subordinates? Kun ba is on manu hor under od zibla ke kam kore. He under od kam kora manu bila kok subordinates bila kwa zhe. So he subordinates or dara kam khini koru wa tu. Ba te ho lukok motivate kora wa tu that everything will come under directing or leading. Next is controlling. It is the process of setting standards for performance. Checking to see how actual performance compares with these set standards and taking corrective actions as needed. Mane controlling a key core, mane already the organization will decide kya mak inequa inequa output lage, inequa inequa results lage. He zikini output by results set kora thake, aru actual employees zikini output by results ye, he gute kini compare kore bole, but zikini disari se, he kini python and I. Zodi nai kwa nukwa gani kun kini corrective action kori bo lebo, kiki corrections kori bo lebo, that comes under controlling. Next, the second category is the operative functions. Now, managerial functions to kiya sa lebo as a whole for the entire organization. But operative functions bila ki hoi, it is, it depends, it is relevant to a specific department. At the zikuna eta department or bila operative functions. Functions. Okay. The operative or uh, also called service functions are those which are relevant to a specific department. These functions vary from department to department. Mane department to department bila functions bila bila kwa. So department or aka operative functions not hake. Depending on the nature of the department, these functions include procurement, development, compensation and maintenance functions of HRM. HRM mane human resource management. Now the first is procurement. Procurement means that procure kora means obtain kora. Zee kunu bostu yata pwa. So yate ki pwa ar kotha mean kore se ki zee kunu yata particular kama or karne par eta department or belek belek department or belek belek kama thake. So for a particular department, for a particular job, what kind of people do you need to obtain? Eta particular kama or karne 
কি ধরনের মানুষ লাগিব যাতে সেইখানে কাম করব পড়ে সো দ্যাট ইজ নোন এজ প্রক্রিয়মেন্ট ইট ইনভলভস প্রক্রিয়িং দ্য রাইট কাইন্ড অফ পিপল ইন এপ্রোপ্রিয়েট ম্যানার টু বি প্লেসড ইন দ্য অর্গানাইজেশন ইট কনসিস অফ এক্টিভিটিজ লাইক ম্যান পাওয়ার প্ল্যানিং রিক্রুটমেন্ট সিলেকশন প্লেসমেন্ট এন্ড ইন্ডাকশন অর অরিয়েন্টেশন অফ নিউ এমপ্লয়িজ নেক্সট ইজ ডেভেলপমেন্ট লাইক আই টোল্ড ইউ হোয়াট ইজ ডেভেলপমেন্ট ডেভেলপমেন্টে কি করে এমপ্লয়িজ বিলাক অফ নলেজ দিয়ে স্কিলস দিয়ে অলরাউন্ড ডেভেলপমেন্ট করে অফ দ্য এমপ্লয়িজ পার্সোনালিটি এটিটিউড গোটে অলরাউন্ড ডেভেলপমেন্ট উইল কাম আন্ডার ডেভেলপমেন্ট সো দিস ফাংশন ইনভলভস এক্টিভিটিজ মেন্ট টু ইম্প্রুভ দ্য নলেজ স্কিলস এপটিটিউডস এন্ড ভ্যালুজ অফ এমপ্লয়িজ সো এজ টু এনেবল দেম টু পারফর্ম দেয়ার জবস ইন আ বেটার ম্যানার ইন ফিউচার This functions may comprise training to employees, executive training to develop managers, organization development to strike a better fit between organizational climate, culture and employees. Organizational climate or culture means that it is a work environment of the organization. Hey, uh, work environment to fit for employees is like this, so it is a development to do it. Next is compensation. Compensation of what is the salaries or the wages, the remuneration is given. যাতে সেই যাতে ফেয়ার হয় কামটোর হিসাবত যাতে সেইখানে যোনে যদি কাম করেছে সেই কামটোর হিসাবত যাতে পয়সাটা পাই না তাত কম পাই না তাত বেশি ফেয়ার হয় যাতে পয়সাটা দ্যাট উইল কাম আন্ডার কম্পেনসেশন মানে জবটা আমি ইভালুয়েট করব সেই জবটা কিমান ইম্পর্টেন্ট হয় বা কিমান টান হয় হাও হার্ড দ্য ওয়ার্ক ইজ এন্ড সেই হিসাবত উই উইল ডিসাইড হোয়াট টাইপ অফ স্যালারি অর হোয়াট টাইপ অফ রেমুনারেশন হ্যাজ টু বি পেইড টু দ্যাট পার্টিকুলার এমপ্লয় Compensation function involves determination of wages and salaries matching with contribution made by employees. Mani, the kuna is an employee ki maan thini contribute kori se to the organization. Organization or jikhini goals thakke, hey goal kini meet kori bo karne, employer to sonor contribution ki maan hoi, hey contribution to hisa bot, teok salary to diya za bo. In other words, this function ensures equitable and fair remuneration for employees in the organization. It consists of activities such as job evaluation, wage and salary administration bonus incentives etc next is maintenance it is concerned with protecting and promoting employees while at work for this purpose uh, various benefits such as this should be various i'm sorry various benefits such as housing medical educational transport facilities etc are provided to the employees several social security measures such as provident fund pension gratuity group insurance etc are also arranged mane it's like the this uh, it is done for the welfare of the employees mane welfare is to already ami agota koisu various belek dhorner facility diya jay belek belek dhorner like medical facilities educational facilities transport facilities and also tomalake uh, khunisa sage it is uh, you know what is provident fund man like retire korar pichot jekhini lump sum amount diya jay Uh, the money that is paid that is known as the provident fund the pension dia jay after retirement monthly due to dia jay that is known as pension by insurance all these facilities that will come under maintenance now what is human resources planning as defined by bulla and scott human resource planning is the process for ensuring that human resource requirements of an organization are identified and plans are made for satisfying those requirements মানে যে কোনো একটা অর্গানাইজেশনের কিমানখিনি হিউমেন রিসোর্স রিকোয়ারমেন্ট আছে মানে কিমানখিনি মানুষ লাগে এমপ্লয়ি লাগে ম্যান পাওয়ার লাগে অর্গানাইজেশনটা সেইখিনি ডিসাইড করা সেইখিনি আইডেন্টিফাই করা আর সেই রিকোয়ারমেন্টখিনি কেন সেটিসফাই করা যাব মানুষখিনি কেন রিক্রুইট করা যাব দ্যাট এন্টায়ার প্ল্যান দ্যাট ইজ নোন এজ দ্য হিউমেন রিসোর্স প্ল্যানিং অলসো রেলি হ্যাজ ডিফাইন্ড হিউমেন রিসোর্সেস প্ল্যানিং অর ওয়ার্ক ফোর্স প্ল্যানিং এজ a process in which an organization attempts to estimate the demand for labor and evaluate the size nature and sources of supply which will be required to meet the demand so similarly agor to nisna ji kon eta organization or kiman khini labor lagibo he labor to decide korar karane aro he source to mane por pra ami kiman khini labor pam kenu ka dhoronor labor pam he demand to meet koribo karane that is known as human resource planning Now we come to recruitment and selection. Like I have already said, what is recruitment? Recruitment refers to the process where potential applicants are searched for and then encouraged to apply for an actual or anticipated vacancy. Mane, ji kunu eta organization ar jeta manhu laga hoy, human resource laga hoy, manpower laga hoy, jeta ki korbo lagbo? First they have to identify ki kunu kun to dhoronor kamor karone kenu ka dhoronor manhu lage, then they have to publish the advertisement 
for the vacancy ki amak enuka enuka manhu lage tare form fill up applications bisaribo lagibo then the people have to apply for that apply korar pichot screen koribo laibo ki kenuka kenuka manhu ahise applications dise tar bitorot kak kak interview lobo pare jay that entire process is known as the recruitment and what follows recruitment recruitment or pichot ki hoy the selection happens after recruitment so what is selection selection is the process of hiring employees among the shortlisted candidates and providing them a job in the organization mane jibur candidates se apply korisile vacancy tur karane jar jar interview lua hoyse sei interview tur pora finally jizon deserving candidate hoy ba jibur deserving candidate hoy hei burok ami job tu dia to that is known as the selection jiblak ami undeserving candidates hoy eburok ami reject kori diu and jiblak deserving candidates hoy those are selected or hired and that process is known as the selection so what are the differences between recruitment and selection firstly recruitment is the process of advertising for vacancies attracting interviewing selecting and hiring employees or selection ki hoy selection is the process where a company picks the best candidates mane jibur sob recruitment of jiman bor candidate ahile tar ekdor best candidates lako pick kora to is known as selection out of the hundreds of applications received recruitment involves everything from the identification of a hiring uh, need to filling uh, and selection involves choosing the right candidate from the applications received mane recruitment at good stay process to hoy starting from the identification of a hiring need mane amak inukan ka mathu lage he need to identify korar pa filling o loke that entire process is known as recruitment aru selection to ki hoy jitu ami choose kora jay right person kon hobo right jiman bura hise tar bhitor right candidate kon to hobo that is known as selection recruitment occurs first and selection follows recruitment like i told you already and the main objective of recruitment is to encourage a large number of candidates to apply for a post while the main objective of recruit uh, selection sorry it should be selection is to select the right candidate for the post next we come to training and development training and development refers to educational activities within a company created to enhance the knowledge and skills of employees while providing information and instruction on how to better perform specific tasks i have already told you what is training and development we kono eta organization or bhitor jiblak programs kora jay to give knowledge and skills to the employees so shikabole jiblak kora jay programs that will come under training and development what is training training is a program organized by the organization to impart knowledge and skills in the employees as per the requirement of the particular job ji kono ejon employee ji tu nijor job kore he job tu hisabot he training tu diya jay and it is a short term process and what is development development is an ongoing systematic process throughout the working period development hoy thake training tu ketia hoy it happens regularly ji kono eta time ot after certain intervals majhe majhe training programs kora jay but development is an ongoing process throughout the working period employees bilak or development hoy thake in their conceptual and theoretical knowledge aru hetu ji kono eta particular task kor karane no hoy but it improves the personality and attitude of the all round growth so development is not only limited to a particular task but it aims to improve the personality and attitude for their all round growth which will help them to face future challenges future of the black challenge was that either working in that organization by her organization to error piece of life of the black challenge was that he will face kuribo karne you need development that is provided in the organization and it is an ongoing systematic process next we come to performance appraisal now what is performance appraisal now jene ke tumalokor college ot jene ke tumalokor report card diya jay grade sheet diya jay ki tumalokor performance tu kenu kwa hoyse to semester ba hetu year ot either you have perform poor or fair or good excellent outstanding ba tumalokor marks diya jay percentage diya jay ki man paisa at the end of the semester or the end of the year similarly in organizations also they maintain such record organization to tenu ka record maintain kora jay ki as an employee nijor job ot kene ka perform korise kam khini kene ke korise bhalke korise na nai ba he country company to ba organization to kiman khini contribute koribo parise he record je to maintain kore he maintain kora process to kwa jay performance appraisal so a performance appraisal is a regular review of an employee's job performance and overall contribution to a company Lastly, we come to industrial safety. Uh, now, uh, construction industry employs skilled, semi-skilled, and unskilled labor in millions to execute several civil engineering projects. 
in public and private sectors. Now, construction is highly accident prone industry. Majority of accidents at construction sites are due to unsafe conditions and can be prevented if safety precautions are understood and enforced and implemented at sites of work. So, construction industry can be bibhinna dhorna accident dekha pao. Kindu zodi he accident villa kor karni safety precautions lua zai tene hole tene kwa dhorna accidents bura me prevent kori bo paru. So, let us see what are the common causes of accidents. Lack of effective communication oral or written among different workers or contractors. So, how do you communication not hake, he can make a come corribole, he come corribole, as the workers or contractors or not taking a cotabatra no hoy or written tenukaku instruction not hake, then it can cause accidents. Non use of protective gear in different contexts. Protective gear maneki, Jigono industry by work site or come corrode, by company come construction site or come corrode, manuhe. Protective gear is man pinhibole like uh, pinhibole like like you wear a helmet, you have to wear eye gear, so could pinhibole like a hat or gloves pinhibole like you have to wear protective shoes. Hebu horror, hebla protective gear to use kora nazai, then it can lead to accidents. Lack of security and monitoring at site of work. Use of substandard materials or equipment and non adherence to specification guidelines. When is the black machine use for as a material use for as a head black or the quality of hal no hoy. Low quality is the hair material use for as I by use for as a guidelines like a guidelines who is follow for an asai then it can cause accidents. Next is storage of hazardous material without permission and beyond allowed capacity and when allowed without. Proper security measures. If like hazardous materials, okay, it can either be chemical materials, it can be explosives. Can be like, so I mean, store for it. How? Demand store for it. Well, I get after so the basic store for it. How? But so the permission no longer store for it. But security measure no longer store for it. It can lead to accidents. And recently, we have seen such kind of accident, a uh, very uh, drast, very disastrous accident happening in Lebanon. So, uh, chemical store for it. So, a very high quantity of material was stored. And it led to a very big explosion and loss of life and property. So next we come to unclear debris or equipment. Ziblak amar ziblak waste materials thake hi waste materials ziblak ba machines ziblak zodi ami phalke zodi store not ho zote tote zodi pelai thori dia zai ba waste material ziblak zodi safa kora na zai time out then it can lead to accidents. Tapi zui lagi bo pare ba bivino thoro accident ho pare tapi lack of training in safety matters zodi training na thake ki kena ke safety precautions logo laga zai. Alcoholism of workers on duty, so the duty time of the workers will like alcohol kai uh, hobo par accidents. Failure of construction equipment, improper or unsafe operation of lifts, electric shocks, struck by falling objects, man uporpa uh worker kam ko uporpa kiba bostu a hike poribo pare. Caving in of sides of excavated deep trenches, kiba honor the excavation kora zai or excavation to pitor the workers take, side or pas de matihini kohi pore, then it can lead to accidents, unsafe material handling and storage, fall from height due to unsafe scaffolding. Scaffolding means ki asile, ji kuno ata building ba structure, high rise structures the construct kora zai. Tita ki kora zai side or bahor ba kathor tate ami ata framework bonai loi zwa zai. Zot manhur workers buchio hoy pelai zato support loi pelai kamto kore bo pai. So he do zori unsafe hoy tapa workers bu pori zabo and as a result it can cause damage and also. Uh, Along with scaffolding, you can fall from ladders or zodi platform bilak or side of zodi railing na thake ba upper ziblak floors thake building or building of floor bilak or side of zodi projections na thake. Then people can the workers can fall down and it can lead to big accidents. Now, how can these accidents be prevented? The firstly is provide safety training for all employees. Employers should educate employees on all workplace safety standards and the hazards that they can face while on the job. Workers need to review the health and safety policies for each job they are called to do. The written safety policy should include procedure and name and location of a trained first aid responder. Employees should not operate any equipment they are not qualified or trained to use. So, zi kunu ata kam kori bokarne, ba zi kunu ata equipment use kori bokarne, machine use kori bokarne, proper training lage. So, hey training kini zate employer bilake nizo employee kini diye, aru ki ki safety. Maintain safety precautions, level like safety maintain, level like a hey, kini zate education employees kini dia zai. Hold frequent crew safety missions. This is similar to the previous one. Ki uh, frequently zate like meetings conduct kora zai either daily or weekly. Ki mane kid honor uh, kam choli asa zate hey kam bilak like, kore bokar ne kid honor ami precautions level like zai ki ki safety issues level like zai. That those things should be discussed in the meetings. 
Utilize protective clothing and gear. Workers should always wear the recommended safety equipment for their jobs. This may be a hard hat. High visibility clothing. High visibility clothing kya lagya zodi clothing bilag visible na hoy duror pora. Jeta workers bilag ko duror pa zodi dekha po na zay then it can lead to accidents. Zodi manhuzon zodi prominently dekha po na zay. So zibilag kapur pinhe ba zibilag gear pinhe those should be visible from a distance. Duror pa zate dekha po zay workers na. Goggles because for eye protection. Gloves lagya steel toed shoes. Because uh, uh, the feet should be protected or a protective suit. So, a board honor, we uh, not honor protective clothing and gear for different types of works, and this should be definitely used by all the workers. Keep the workspace clean. Now, the workplace, like I have already told you, the raw material, the debris, the waste material, the clear for an azai, the nails, the gozal, the equipment uh, uh, accident Next, maintain the equipment and tools. Before using a piece of equipment or machinery, workers must ensure it is in proper working order. So the machine to the equipment to the machine to the accident. So the tools and machinery should be kept on a regular inspection. To regularly inspect Next, we come to prevent falls. Now, falls are the leading cause of fatalities in the construction industry. It is important that workers are protected from falls on the job. I have already told you, like scaffolding, proper scaffolding, proper ladder, railing, the workers might fall from a height. And here to prevent, we should ensure that there is scaffolding, good quality scaffolding, that a railing, and the ladders are of good quality. Recognize the hazards and make a plan. Before any project starts, the site should be inspected for any unusual hazards. A risk assessment can protect workers' health and safety. After completing the risk assessment, a list of preventive measures should be made and implemented. It is important to ensure that all workers receive appropriate in education, information, and training. So, we can decide a project decide for us. Like, if we do a project for us, by an organization or a company, hey, project to for us, if we decide for us, hey, project to for us, agote, you have to decide that hey, project to ki ki thoronor risk thake, ba ki ki thoronor hazard thake, di bilake a workers or health or safety uh, risk kore bo pare. So, hey, kini uh, list bonwa bonabo lagibo. You have to assess the entire the risk involved in the work. In the work that you are giving to the workers or the employees, and hey, hisabe, the organization or the employers have to plan out ki hey, come to kore bokane ki ki thorn of preventive measures lobo legibo or safety procedures follow kore bokane. Next is be careful with vehicles, working uh, work sites, bilakoba construction sites, bilakob, we will not honor vehicles, thake hey, be a vehicle, like it can be either. Uh, Excavators, hobo pare, bulldozers, hobo pare. So, hey, but normal zip no vehicle hobo pare. So, hey, vehicle will have a proper driving so that there are no accidents. We have to ensure that there is proper driving. And, head to run a key for a bullet. We have to ensure defensive driving, proper parking, our backing, back there should be ample space that a good honor workers or good honor that a gari carne that a accident. Use equipment in the manner prescribed. Now, Zetia Kumba at the construction site or Zikunu machine ba equipment that I install for us, you always get a uh, you always get the guidelines with it or the user user manual with it. Kiki horne he to use for a machine to kid horne use for a equipment to kid horne use for a bolebo, kiman speed out use for a bolebo, but temperature to kill a kiman kiki temperature di bolebo, kiki safety precautions for bolebo. That's everything are mentioned in the user manual or the user guidelines. So those guidelines or those ma that manual has always to be followed when you work with that particular machine or that equipment. And without reading the manual, nobody should use the machine or the equipment. Follow construction guidelines and report any dangerous working conditions. Now, the construction or carne construction guidelines ki suman thake government or set kora, the block follow the block follow those uh, the organizations or the companies they have to follow those guidelines otherwise heblak illegal hoy if you are not following those guidelines during the construction or you are violating those guidelines then you can meet with accidents because hey guidelines bilakot bibhinna dhoronor safety measures mention kora thake if you don't follow those guidelines construction guidelines set 
then you can meet the employees or the workers can meet with meet with different kinds of accidents so enuka jodi kumbai jodi dekhe ki kiba construction site or work site or jodi ebla construction guidelines bla follow nokora ke kam choli ase then they should be immediately reported to the authorities so we come to the end of the first part of this chapter in the next class we will discuss the second part of this chapter